welcome to our life in the Philippines. So, um, as you can see, we are not home today. We are, we actually took an early morning day trip and um, just about an hour, hour and a half um, south of here in a place called Lubao. Uh, Janice has some uh, relatives that lives down here. It is still in Papanga, so there is no no travel requirements as far as that goes, um, as we are staying within the same province. <clears throat> but we're looking into getting a uh, QR code, I guess they call it now. But this area has uh, some really nice um, views here. I don't know if you can see that. I, I did take some photographs earlier and I, I might put them in. But if you look back down here, you can see the mountains, even though they are actually, right now, it looks like it could be even raining over there, covered by clouds to a large degree. Uh, and uh, this area is farmland. And uh, I think Janice's uncle has the land behind. That's their house down here. And uh, the land behind here. And um, uh, it, right now, it looks like they actually planted corn in the rice field, right? Yeah. So they have planted corn. Here, obviously, it's uh, rice. Uh, but, and then you see these little um, concrete channels here full of water and that's how they pump the water in and out and recycle reclaim the water and pump it back out in the rice fields again and now uh, here's Janice she is out here blogging today too so so it's uh, we're both going to be out blogging today and uh, actually not so much blogging we, we decided we're going to do our exercise down here. We try to get out of the areas where you have uh, all the fumes and exhaust and all that. And this is a good, good little area. Look at the views, guys. It's, and uh, down here, actually, down here, actually, uh, I had some subscribers that were asking they wanted to buy farmland, and I think there is some farmland for sale down here. Um, if you have any interest, we can do inquiries for you. Um, if you... Hello. Hello, wifey. Okay. Oh, I forgot my mask, but... We're not gonna... We're not gonna be with anybody today, so... Maybe we can buy one up here. These masks are... <clears throat> We're not with any people anyway. There is not a person in sight, so... So we're gonna go back down here and probably walk over on that side a little bit. We shall see how far we get today. But it feels good to uh, feels good to be out a little bit, drive around, and for some reason today I'm I'm kind of losing my voice again. I do that when when it gets a little hot and sweaty, I start losing my voice. It's funny how that happens, but it does. I've done that for a long time in my life, as long as I can remember. So. <clears throat> But this is how people live here. Very peaceful, clean, no, no pollution at all. It's just beautiful. Love it. Even have a sorry store, it looks like it's closed, but they have a little box there that they set up for sorry store. Not a rice field. Over there in the horizon it looks like corn as well. So well we shall see. But I figured I'll take you on this walk. Sun is sun is in our face here, so 
So it's a little, a little hot today, guys. But it's a beautiful day, though. Scenic, scenic. I take you on a scenic tour. So, coming down here, we had a lot of traffic for some reason today. It is, to me, it is very apparent that traffic has kind of gotten back to normal. Um, if nothing else is, the traffic's for sure is back to normal, and it is, it is, uh, it was uh, pretty, pretty intense today. Total stops at several times, so. I could live out here. Um, I actually, many times I'm, I'm thinking, wish I could go to the island. Look at that, you have a cat sitting right there. <laughs> He's kind of checking me out. It's a big one too, look at his neck around that thing. He's a big, big cat. One thing I see here, though, you know, is uh, I'm not alone. I'm not alone not wearing a mask. Um, here comes the guy. He does wear it. He's an official truck driver, I guess. But I see a lot of kids don't wear it at all. Yeah, there you go. You have yes. calamansi trees. Yeah, and your uncle has a lot of avocado too, right? He has at least two big trees, right? Two jackfruit. Yeah, but mango, they have... Uh, man mango, 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 not avocado, mango. Yeah, no, no avocado. Yeah, big, big oh. av uh, mango trees. Calamansi. Two or three. Yes, but there's a calamansi tree right there, and I think yeah. that's calamansi too, actually. So, it is... It is, yeah, it, it is hot. I agree. It is hot. My wife says, my wife says it's too hot to walk today. Yeah, what time is it now? Um, like one? In the afternoon? Yeah. No, probably three. Probably three o'clock. Oh, no barking. Oh, doggy, no barking. Oh, were you were you barking? Were you barking? Were you barking? Were you barking? Oh, you're so you're so cute. You little cutie. You know, he's just scared. That's what it is. He looks like a little. Yeah. There's a cow right there. Yeah. I don't know if you guys can see it right right back there. A white cow. And there's another one down there. There's like three, four, five of them here. Yeah. I don't know guys if you hear it's really windy. Oh, come on. Stop yapping. Okay. So wifey says go back. I wanted I wanted to visit the community over there because there's a bunch of people living over there. There's a bunch of fire. Yeah, I remember I remember but, when there's a parachute or something. Oh yeah, like the balloon festival. Oh, no, I mean balloon festival. <laughs> One of the balloons Parachute over, uh, no, is it a parachute? No, balloon. No, balloons. <laughs> Not parachute, <laughs> but the balloon and, and a we lot landing, of the... Landing, landing on that area. So, me and Shell were... Yeah, we... Right, go over there, run over there. We were running over there. Maybe I can find some footage. Yeah. Um, from that balloon festival and I'll uh, enter it in here, but that was over. Over, over, right over on that that side. It was last year. We were we were here, and several actually of the balloon travelers ended up in these rice fields, and uh, it was it was interesting to see when <laughs> when the trucks and stuff were trying they were trying to pull them out of the rice field, um, and in some instances, I, I think they managed to fire the balloons up again and just get them, 
lifting off just a little bit off the ground and pushing them up to the side of the road. But it was interesting to see that, what they did. Yeah, so I, it's hard to see here maybe, but there's a cool cow. One, two, three, four, five, six. And uh, that, yeah, and that, it's a little one there too, do you see it? Yeah, ba baby calf. So just take off my jacket. I didn't notice that I wear a jacket. So just take off because it's too hot. Yeah, you're dressed like winter clothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why you're sweating. Yeah, but anyway, you know, at least you get to see these guys. It's um, I I just love it here. I wish I had a drone. I could fly over on the other side and and uh, do do a little bit. But that's on my purchase list to get but I've been holding off due to the COVID here you know why do you need a drone when you can't go nowhere and you can't you can't fly it inside the city and all that stuff so but here I'm sure you could it's beautiful 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 yeah you too are beautiful. Yeah, my wife is beautiful. It is very pretty here. A lot of, lot, lot of stuff. Um, I'll show you some photographs. I show you a little bit of everything here, and, and uh, we go from there and see see what's what's there that's the ice cream man dirty ice cream that's what they're selling You know, people live live here. To some big houses. Filipinos typically don't don't paint their house yeah. uh, on the outside. Uh, inside they do, but on the outside they don't polish it. It's just a block. And uh, when they live like this in the farm country, uh, even though you see maybe that pink cows right through the bushes there you see that that looks like it's finished has a finish on it and uh, the blue one there but it's still up top if you see up top there it doesn't have finishing oh yeah oh yeah they have a bunch of ducks and you know what do you what do you expect it's farm country There you have some people out there working in the rice fields. So. My wife is out chasing ducks. She is chasing duck ducks. What do you say, hon? Calamansi trees? Yep, yeah, I see that. Right down there, it's calamansi all the way there. Calamansi, citrus, citrus fruit. I want to pick it, but it's not mine. No, you should not pick anything that doesn't belong to you.
All right, so. That was just a little 10 minute or so walk, guys, and uh, that be it for this video. Um, Le Bao, beautiful area, and uh, pretty much farmland, flat, and then you see, like I said earlier, you see all the mountains in the background. It's, uh, the views are very, very, very pretty. It's um, a place where I could imagine myself living, but we will go to Samar, where we have beautiful beaches, plenty of coconut, and uh, that's where we're going to go and try to settle down my last years and see how that goes. All right, guys. Thank you for watching, God bless, and we'll see you soon again. Wait, don't click that button unless of course you hit the subscribe button and then you can move on. And while you're down there, hit the notification button as well. And if you leave a like or a comment, we will personally respond to you on all or any requests you might have. And thank you for watching and we'll see you again at the next video.